Hey, we're playing Darkest Dungeon today. I don't know what it is, but it looks cool as hell. I saw a video and blew my mind. <laughs> Artwork. Amazing. Yeah, it's got some pretty cool artwork, I think. I like it a lot. Oh, I can't put a... Sp oh, yeah, I can't put a space. There we go. You gotta be Bumford Senior. You're gonna be Bumford Senior. What? No. I don't want to be dark, so I want to be Bumford Senior. Something about dungeon crawling and Cthulhu. <laughs> are we going? Are we going to a dungeon? You will arrive along the old road. I think we're going to the darkest dungeon. It winds with a troubling <laughs> serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside, leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. Oh my There's God! Going to ever more. It's cobbles Nintendo of the old road, and on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. The uh, words in this game make me feel like I'm in high school English class again. It's looking a lot like this was just a bad idea. The old road will take you to hell. Yeah, so my ancestor... Oh, yeah, we're going to hell. Great. Yeah. My ancestor opened a scary door and unleashed all sorts of horrors upon the earth, and we're going to go reclaim our birthright by going back to the mansion where he did this. Seems like a great idea. It, all, it sounds like a, a lot like we're cleaning up after our ancestors. Well, what a dick. I feel like that maybe he shouldn't have done that. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, hindsight's twenty twenty. There's probably going to be some bullshit story arc where it's like, oh, he was driven to madness by the whores underneath the, uh, the castle. It wasn't his fault. It was Cthulhu's fault. It's bullshit. All right, oh, so we've we got, got guys. Uh, we got guys. We've got Reynald, the Crusader, and Dismas, the Highwayman. What possesses a Crusader and a Highwayman to hang out with each other? Um, I am absolutely blown away by this art. <laughs> I am less than blown away by the. Uh, Lack of frame rate. <laughs> the, the hamlet is just ahead. I'm wondering if maybe the capture software is having some issue. Plus, it's really hot today too. So I yeah, think it's like 96 degrees today. Oh shit! Oh, we've got a brigand cutthroat. He's like, oh shit! I didn't see you guys. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. Kill the enemy. Combat is turn-based. On your turn, on your hero's turn, click a skill icon and click on a highlighted target. If you can't select a particular skill, it's because that hero needs to be standing in a different spot or there are no valid targets. Mouse over the skill to see the requirements. Okay. All right. So we've got Dismas here, and he can either do the open vein or the grape shot blast one. Okay. Um. Let's open this dude's veins. Like, fuck you. Bam! Seven damage. Oh man, he resisted. Oh, uh, resisted. That's okay. Reynard's gonna. What a person, me douche. He's gonna fuck him up. Confidence surges as the enemy crumbles. Oh yeah, two hundred and fifty gold. Remind Take that shit. That overconfidence is a slow and insidious killer. <laughs> man, what the fuck? <laughs> This game's already trying to get inside my brain. While exploring, you will often find interactive objects. Click or press W to investigate, then take a look at this tech. 
So we that, gotta that's a tent, all right. So we got to press X to Sean. Do what? Have you never heard that press X to Sean? No. I'll have to show you that video later. It's basically someone had a a, a glitch in their game of a heavy rain. Leave nothing unchecked. Okay. There is much to be found in forgotten places. And in like inappropriate situations, it, it, it like says press X to, to to yell Sean, and he's like Sean, <gasps> Sean. Oh yeah, I know. <laughs> Stop stepping on my feet. <laughs> You're creeping me out, man. It's a spooky forest. We're in a oh. spooky forest. What is going on? What is that number appearing above his head? I don't know, but I don't think I like it. <laughs> Stop. Oh, it's his... It's his stress level. What? Because yeah. he was stepping on his toes? Because he was walking backwards, I guess. I don't think we're welcome anymore. I don't think, I don't think we were welcome to begin with. Who cares? Fucking ba -bam. take that. Shoot both of ya. Oh man, that guy's got a lot of health. Uh, yeah. Oh, we're fucked. We're not even, like, past the first level of the game. <laughs> we're fucked. Well, resisted that, so... Smite his ass. Oh, damn. Twelve? The guy's like, Twelve to the dome. Guys, stop hitting me. Oh, you guys. Oh, damn. See, I took a lot. Wow! Yeah. See, we're fucked. Oh, and I got... Oh, uh, and he... Oh, staggering force! Great commentary on that one. Uh, What was his name? R Renald? Renald. <laughs> yeah. See, I've only got one guy with a gun. They got two guys with a gun. My uh, crusader apparently didn't re read up on bringing a knife to a gunfight, because... That's basically all he's got is a big knife. I like the look on that guy's face, like, oh, ouch. That's, oh, bleed. That smarts. Debuff. <laughs> Alrighty, we're gonna. What are the rest of this stuff is? Yeah. Zealous accusation. Let's let's do that. Ah, yeah. You're a terrible person, and your mother should have aborted you. <laughs> <laughs> Rain of Whips. That doesn't sound he, good. Oh. Oh, well, he dodged and he only took one. Oh, but he's all, he's all stressed, stressed out. out. Like, oh, this, oh, this, takes, me. this takes me back to my slave days. I don't like it. <laughs> no, he's almost got oh, it. That guy's got it. That guy's yeah. dead. Blade. Corpses. When most monsters die, they leave corpses. Corpses act as temporary obstacles and will eventually go away on their own. Uh, you can attack corpses to destroy them faster, but often a better approach is to use ranged skills, push-pull skills, and even corpse-clearing special skills that some heroes possess. Monsters killed will bleed blight with bleed blight or crits leave no corpses at all. Huh. Oh, dude, look at him. That's amazing. He's all, like, <laughs> fucked up. Damn, this game's cool. Ah, uh, and we're bleeding. Yeah, we're bleeding. It's no good. Let's see, can we... Oh, no. Can we zealously accuse him? I can't. Can't? I have to get the corpse out of the way. Yeah, I have to get rid of the corpse here. But yeah, take that! I'm a was gone. He's like, I'm a crusader. I'm a crusader, but I'm not above desecrating the dead. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, cool. Man, they're just picking on Renard. Yeah, they're just like, whatever. Who gives a shit? He's he's the guy. Kill the guy in the armor. He killed the guy who brought that knife to this gunfight. Oh, yeah. That knife just totally beat the shit out of him. Yeah. <laughs> we found an anti-venom, a portrait. Awesome. They can be beaten. And the deed. The deed saying we beat these guys. 
After you've completed the requirements of a quest, you have the option to return to town at any time. Just click the crest. You don't need to return to the starting room of the dungeon to exit. Oh, that's handy. Okay, um, I want to open that treasure chest. Something doesn't look quite right with this one. Oh, never mind. No, I don't want to open that. Are you sure? Well, we'll do it with the guy, with this guy. He's, he's, got, the, more he's, he's got the most health. He'll be all right. Oh, no, it's trapped. That's wizardry all oh, over again. He got blighted. There ain't nothing in there, is there? All right. Well. W to inspect. Let's get the fuck out of here. Hey, look, we got an achievement. Welcome oh. home. Oh, ready. On our way. On our way to 100%. I have a feeling it's not going to be that easy, though. Alright, cool. Plus two resolve. Plus two Whoa, resolve what, what, XP. Whatever, whatever this yeah. is. Unerring. Plus 10% damage ranged skills. Ooh. <laughs> Fantastic. He can the the, the he melee can... fighter has bonus damage to range. Yes, he can zealously <laughs> accuse people from afar quite accurately. Cove Scrounger. 10% scouting chance in Cove. I don't know what any of that is. I don't know, but I'm already liking it. The red question mark on a hero's portrait indicates they are unavailable for the week. Well, why the fuck are they unavailable for the week? Well, you know, home. someone called home, they got Such kids. It is. <laughs> <laughs> this is yeah, I, got, I can't adventure today, I got a birthday party to go to. <laughs> Sorry guys, my kids got the flu. Um, I'm gonna have to take the day off. Uh, my wife will kill me even harder than these Cthulhu monsters. <laughs> Renald and Dismas successfully escorted you to the Hamlet. Oh! Okay. Makes a little more sense. We're Bumford Senior, and this is our estate, and those are adventurers that we hired to escort us here. That's so, awesome. So if uh, if we're Bumford Senior, and this is our estate, is the ancestor who opened the door is that Bumford Junior? That would be Bumford Senior, Senior Junior. This is the all four. kinds of con confusing <laughs> family tree. Okay, so ancestors' memoirs. In time, you will know the tragic oh, that's to watch the failings. the movies. Yeah, this I guess this is the guy that fucked up and shot himself because he fucked up. Um, the graveyard. Most will end up yep. here. Covered in the poisoned earth. Oh look, we get another achievement oblivion. for going to the graveyard. Awesome. I'm guessing this is where uh, we got to press square to to pay respects. Yeah. <laughs> no, I think this is where our list of dudes go when they die. Like, oh look, Renault died. We can go visit his horribly mangled corpse in the graveyard. Uh, stagecoach. Women and men. Soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses, all will find their way to us now that the road is clear. The stagecoach is your hero lifeblood. You'll need to recruit these two heroes to fill out a party of four. Drag and drop them into your roster. While you're here, spend some of your starting resources on upgrading the stagecoach network. This will increase the number of heroes available here in the future. To upgrade, click the plus symbol on the left and then... Click the upgrade, okay. Sounds like we're going to want to upgrade that. Oh, we've got Frossart, the Seeker Plague Doctor, and Bluet, Seeker Vestal. Great, they're both French. we got three French, three French people in my, <laughs> in my group. This isn't going to go well. They're going to run away. I was going to say so. <laughs> so if, if they're French, it would be Frossois, Frossois, and Bluet. Blue, and Renault. Uh, I don't remember enough of my. And Dismas. I don't remember enough of my French. Okay, so we have to hit the plus button, and then uh, increases the number available. Here is three. It increases the size of the roster to twelve. 
I think I want a bigger roster. Well, we already have nine in our roster, so. Oh, we can buy both. Okay. Because we've got. We've got. We have enough deeds. Deeds and, and crests, apparently. Great heroes can be found even here in the mud and rain. Man, the voiceover is cool in this game. Yeah, I'm I'm digging it. So, oh, okay, I'm guessing Embark is what lets us go to uh, to a dungeon. So, uh, I guess next time we'll go take a look at some of these dungeons. We'll go Dungeoneering. Our, we'll go Dungeoneering. I was oh, born for this. See, she's born oh, for she, this. Oh, she's ready. She's ready. We're going to kick some ass down in the uh, the slightly dark dungeon. I'm just picturing them going to catacombs, but this is bullshit. This is catacombs. This clearly is not a dungeon. I was expecting it to be darker. 